Yeah, well, it'd been a big week because um, yeah, probably a couple of weeks prior to that, Donald McDonald and myself had gone out to Simo and out to his house um, and sat down with uh, Nicole and, and Simo about you know his future and where he saw that and you know we basically come to the conclusion that you know he wouldn't be going on next year and that you know we basically gave him you know, which game he wanted to serve farewell in and um, when he wanted to pull the pin whether it was at season's end or whether he wanted to serve you know um, retire a little bit earlier and give a couple of young guys an opportunity to step up in the uh, in the midfield and he decided to take that second option um, I think it was th with three games to go and uh, yeah, so the whole week, that whole week was uh, about, you know, billed as, as Simo's last game for the club. Uh, I'm announcing my retirement. Look, I just think it's time. Uh, it's been a great ride. Look, whether I play another three games or five games, it, it, it doesn't really matter. And, and when you think like that, I suppose the time is right. This week's um, the last game. Uh, the family's definitely uh, number one in my... Uh, my priorities and that's something we tell our players when they come in that your, your family's first and the club's a long way second. There is obviously going to be a big week uh, for him and also the club. Look to make sure you take upon yourself this week to recover it to the best of your ability and ready to go Friday night. This is not good for you. It's not even, it's not even proven. Oh. I'm the only one who buys the songs. Well, I'm the one to bring the funk. I'm a bit out of touch. <laughs> <laughs> I just thought I'd uh, read parts of this article I found, written by Phil Gould. The team that wins this year's competition will be the side that defends the best and thinks the longest. Individuals are improving every week and each player is looking to have a positive impact <coughs> on the rest of the team. Sounds familiar? Bit of some time of year because it's round 18 and we haven't played Carlton. Uh, we need to shut it down in the midfield and make sure the ball that does go into their forward line isn't as clean as what we've seen. I reckon we need to pull them into the trenches a little bit. We can get in there one on one, I think we can do some damage. Take your backpack off, mate. Good boy. You right? Set boats on. You want to run out in the ground on Friday, Ali? And are you going to wear footy boots just in case we need you? All right, let's go. You know, give me a kiss, goodbye. See you, champ. See you after school. Give me a laugh. I need a kiss. All right, see you, mate. All right, bye bye. All right, let's go home. See you later. Good boy. I've been planning um, for the next phase of my life for a long time. I've got a a young family, and I know that uh, you still have to work. The AFL is the best industry in the world. I don't see why you'd want to go away from it. So that's my personal point of view, and I'm, I'm looking forward to staying involved in AFL if I can. If not, it'll be footy somewhere. Simo's last seven of the team meeting. Uh, the last five weeks, and for the next five weeks, it's going to be more about us anyway, and how we're going about our football. So we're taking the information about the opposition, but we've got to get our own, our own house in order. Yeah. 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 I better get the boots. Yeah, I might be on there. I might be on there. Yeah, slowly. Thanks, mate. I need to come back and sign something for me, mate. Smooth hands with that on me. <laughs> We are right to go, what? Alright, let's go. Come on, boys. Yes, come on, come on. Yeah, hey, hey. Someone just throw something in my calf then. What? Oh, I think I just did my calf. Straight away, Sir came over and 
he was he had a he was almost laughing because I think he couldn't believe it had happened, and said, "Oh, you're not going to believe, Croc. I've done my calf." Hey, Croc. I think I just did my calf. Being, being the jokester that he was, I thought, yeah, good one, Simo. Sure you have. Oh, I'm swearing on the Bible. Please go I can't walk. What are the odds of that happening? Can you believe that? Came in and, um, yeah, it was, wasn't, wasn't great news. So I, I went and grabbed one of these sports ready, uh, game ready ice machines that you can put on overnight. And yeah, how's the luck, eh? But anyway, we'll, uh, we'll be right. Thanks, mate. Thanks, Bear. Appreciate everything, mate. Can't even tell, can you?